Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, so today I'm trying to design a form in Excel 2016 and um, I'm just trying to add a date picker here and um, so as you know that Excel um, I think 2010 and above does not have the date picker and I'm trying to um, you know install the date picker for this uh, form. So basically I'm just trying to desi design a, you know, a, um, a form which will do a query to you know databases and this is just a dummy data that I fit in the data so I'm um, not trying to you know show you the how I you know will do the form how it is designed and other stuff in the coming videos but uh, today I'm just trying to add a date picker here and uh, you know I'm just trying to uh, see if that will work uh, so first um, I'm you know going to uh, a Google Drive where I'll you know put um, download link for you as well if you're interested so I'm downloading this um, date picker file it's a uh, ms uh, com cd2 um, dot uh, you know this is um, uh, you know compressed file right now so I've downloaded this file I'll just extract this I'll extract this into a folder okay and uh, we need to you know we need to copy this file into you know our windows folder so first uh, i'll just copy this and then we'll have to register this um, in uh, our computer to make to make it work so i'll just close this for now i'll just close this file for now and i'll copy this file i'm going to my c drive and then i'm going to windows and then I'll go to uh, a folder called sys wow 64 okay and then um, it's sis wow 64 and I'll just paste this file here okay so it says uh, you'll need a permission uh, you know administrator permission so just click on continue so if you already have a file it will ask you to replace it so that means it's already there for you so you don't have to redo this so after you paste this uh, file here you just take the full path of this file by going to properties security and then you copy this whole path that you have pasted and we'll have to you know uh, register this um, for us to be able to use it as a date control so I'm gonna bring up a command cmd and then i'll just um, run it as administrator i'll just confirm it uh, with a yes and then now here you have to uh, write a command it's basically to register so it's reg svr and then it's 32 and then put a space and this space uh, the part that you've copied okay so is REGSVR32 and then hit enter just give it a moment so if everything goes well and you're running this as uh, administrator like I've shown you right now you'll get this uh, message that uh, is um, you know the DLL file has been registered successfully you'll just click on OK so I'm gonna start up my Excel again and then let's see if uh, you know it is registered uh, successfully so I'll try to bring up my file again this is my file so I'm going to open my user form um, so after you register that uh, you'll have to go to your uh, user form and then go to your um, this uh, tools toolbox here so when you click on this you'll see this small you know small uh, you know controls for the user form so from here from the toolbox just right click and uh, click on additional controls so this way you'll be able to you know um, reach out to get this um, the thing that you've installed right now the date picker so from here we'll try to find um, this one Microsoft date and time picker control 6.0 sp6 so if you see this just check this box and then click on OK. So if you can see down here, it's uh, the location of the file is the one we have pasted right now. I'll just click on OK. Okay. 
so here it is this is the date picker i'll just try and uh, just put this so i'll just get rid of that combo box which i put earlier and i'll bring this in so instead of manually putting the date here i want to put a date picker here so i'll just get rid of this as well i'll just copy this and i'll paste this here it's not oh it's right here sorry so this is what i was trying to show you that uh, you can also put a date picker in uh, um office 2016 excel so i hope uh, you know you can use this uh, in your in your forms and you know uh, make it more intuitive and you know easier for users to you know use your form so in the upcoming videos i also want to show you how i designed the forms uh, like this uh, where you can do data synchronization data exports and connecting connecting them to databases um, so this is one of the demo i'll be doing in the future uh, so for now this is so uh, all i want to show you that you can use the date control and the picker sorry um in excel 2016 um, um, you can also use this in any like ms word ms access database uh, as well as uh, in uh, powerpoint so thank you once again for uh, watching this video i hope you found this um, informative and uh, uh, please uh, leave a like and uh, subscribe to our channel as well thank you bye bye